the area of a trapezium. Uh, we want to find, we want to prove the area of the trapezium formula, which is like this. A for trapezium is uh, written in books like this, half times A plus B times H. Okay, now, <clears throat> actually the formula is nothing but uh, base times height. Now, A, when you're doing A plus B divided by 2, so this can also be written as, the same formula can also be written as A plus B divided by 2 times H. This and this are the same. So when you're adding, this is the base, this is one base and this is the second base. So when you're adding two bases and you're dividing by two, you're finding the average of the two bases. So basically this is nothing but the area of a rectangle. Okay, so this is slightly modified form of area of a rectangle, which is base times height. So this I'm calling, this is nothing but the base, okay. This is nothing but, instead of saying base, this is the average of the base. So I'll write like this, average of the base, and this is your height, okay. This is your height. So let us prove this formula, which is very simple. So I'm going to say, if this is height, this is a height, I'll, I'm going to split this into a rectangle and two triangles, okay. So if this is height, H, this is also, height okay so let me use a blue color color coding so this is also h okay now if i call this from year if i say this from year to year if it is x so if this is a this will also be a from year to year from year to year it will be a so let me write a yeah so this whole thing is b this is x and this is a so from year to year this part would be b minus x minus a. I hope you understand. This is this total length minus this minus this will give you this. So let me call this triangle one. This is triangle. So this is this shape is called. I'll call two, and this is this is three. So I'll say one. Okay, one. Okay, so let me not be that short. So can I say area of area of triangle one? Area of triangle. So this is triangle one. Would be area of a triangle is base times half base times height. So it is half times base is x and your height is h. <clears throat> so this is nothing but half h x. Okay, so what is area of uh, area of rectangle? I'll draw a rectangle. <coughs> I'm naming that rectangle two. <coughs> that is base times height. Excuse me. Your base is a and your height is h. So that is a times h, which is a h. Okay, and finally area of triangle three. Area of triangle three would be again half times base what is your base base is this big expression b minus x minus a times h so i'll leave that as it is so therefore this is the notation for therefore in maths area of trapezium area area of trapezium If I want to find the area of trapezium, it is nothing but area of 1 plus 2 plus 3. So I'm going to write this down like this. So this is half hx plus ah plus half. I'll write h first. Half h times b minus x minus a. There's a little bit, bit of algebra here. So let us expand this. <coughs> So let us, uh, you can factor out the h here. So if you factor out the h out, so you have, uh, you what do you have? You have half x plus a plus h. It's already out, so this is half 
times, let me do one more step, b minus x minus a. I'm doing more steps so that you understand. So your h is out, so this is half of x, or half x, plus a, plus half, you know, expanding this, distributing this, so half times b is half b, minus half x, minus half a. I'm just distributing. You have to multiply this with this, this, and this. So half times b is half b, half times x minus, you got a minus there, so half times x is minus half x, and you got a minus here, so I put a minus, and half times a is. Okay, so now what's an interesting thing? Can you see this is half of x, and then you got take away half of x. So what will happen? This and this gets cancelled. Okay, so we can say hoo ha. So this is equal to h times. So let me write this. This is a minus half of a. I'm writing this first and then this plus half of b. So now use your logic. So this is one one a minus half a. What is one a minus half a? One a from one from a you're taking away half of a. So that will be half of a. From a, if you take half a, you'll get half a plus half of b. Okay, so this is nothing but h. So half of a plus half of b is same as half of a plus b. You can factor out half. And this is nothing but half of h times a plus b, which is same as writing half of a plus b times h. Okay, so let us do an example to understand this. <clears throat> let us use that formula and also without the formula. So let me draw a trapezium. Say this is a trapezium. So we know, say this is, say this is 13 centimeters and this is 17 centimeters. So these two sides are parallel. A trapezium is a trapezium if one pair of opposite sides are parallel. And they have given us that this height, <coughs> this height is given to be 10 centimeters. So let us first use the formula. So formula, so this is our A. So this is our A and this is our B and this is our H. So the formula says area, A for area is half of A plus B times H. Okay, so I'm just substitute the values of A, B, and C, which is half of, what is A? 13 centimeters, I'll write the unit, plus 17 centimeters times uh, 10 centimeters. Okay, so this is nothing but half of, this is 30 centimeters times 10 centimeters. So again, so this is, this is half of, this is 300 centimeters squared, which is 150 centimeters squared, 150 centimeters squared. So let us do without the formula. Suppose if you don't know this formula, how would you do it? So we don't know this formula. So let us say we don't know this. Okay, so I'm going to divide this. So this is one triangle and this is the other triangle. Okay, so now if this is 13, I can say this is also 13. Okay, and uh, suppose, let us say we know this side. Okay, we know the length of this side. Generally, it will be equal. So let us say they're equal. Okay, so you've got this is, this and let us say this side is equal to this side. Okay, it's not always the case, but in this case, we can see that this is equal. So I'll go 17 take away 13 is 4 centimeters. So this has to be 2 centimeters and this has to be 2 centimeters. So can I say 
so this is 10 centimeters this is 10 centimeters and this is also 10 centimeters so let me do the working so I'll name this this is say my A this triangle is A this rectangle is B and this triangle is C okay so what is area of A area of A is half half of base times height so base times height is 20 so that is 10 centimeters squared okay the area of triangle or sorry rectangle is base times height so 13 times 10 which is 130 centimeters squared and your C is again base times height so 2 times 10 is 20 which is 10 centimeters squared so can you see the total area the total area is the A for area of the trapezium 130, 140, 150 centimeter squared.